Hello, my name is Alan Workman. I'm with John L. Scott Real Estate out of Anacortes, Washington, and I would like to welcome you to 159 Swinomish Drive in the community of Shelter Bay, the town of Laconner, Washington, Skagit County, and the gateway to the San Juan Islands. This home is 2,200 square feet, two bedroom, three and a half bath, and we'll go inside and take a closer look in a moment. But an often overlooked feature of any house is the available parking area. So if you entertain guests or maybe have weekend visitors, what you want is plenty of off-street parking, and this house offers that. We offer a three-car garage, and as you can see, we've got three cars parked in our driveway and plenty of room for three additional cars. So you'll always have room for your guests, your visitors, and plenty of space for your vehicle. So let's go take a look inside. We've got a grassy area here for outdoor enjoyment during the summer months. You can set your chairs up, maybe have a little barbecue, play area, room for the pets, grandkids, um, plenty of space here. All right, welcome inside. One of my favorite features of this house is this great room. You know, you'll notice that from this end of the house, featuring the gas fireplace all the way to the dining area into the kitchen, we've got vaulted ceilings, we've got cedar lined walls, and we've got this exceptional wall of windows. The wall of windows brings sunshine in during the summer months, as well as heat during the winter months. If it gets a little warm inside, we've got dual sliders on either end, you can bring in that cool ocean breeze. One of the features of this house is the kitchen. Now many people have commented that the kitchen needs some updating and I might agree with that. But look at the space that you have. There's not going to be any walls being knocked down. You know, you're not going to be altering any of the structural elements of the kitchen. You've got a nice bar area here. You've got an island here attached to the wall. You've got plenty of space for cabinetry, new countertops, new appliances. And one of the nice features of this house is the built-in pantry space that lines this wall here and into that closet area there. All right, welcome to the primary bedroom. This room was actually expanded from the original house starting at this wall out. So the original house ended here. But now you can see that they've vaulted the ceiling in the primary bedroom. They put in a skylight in the bathroom. Uh, one of the other features of this home is the Mitsubishi Electric Mini Splits, which offers heat and cool. We have one here in the primary. We have another one in the open concept living room area. This is another one of my special features, uh, in addition to the fireplace there. This bathroom is newer. It does offer a stall shower, but that shower can be easily expanded and to create a very large walk-in shower because immediately behind this shower stall is a linen closet. So again, a little bit of modification to create a nice shower enclosure, all tiled uh, with updated uh, fixtures. As I stated, this is a two bedroom home and this is the guest bedroom. So over here on this wall, we have a Murphy bed. We've got a nice sitting area here. This bedroom is far removed from the primary, offering your guests and visitors privacy. It does feature an ensuite bath with a three-quarter three bath and a walk-in closet. This feature of the home requires little, if any, narration. Just look at this view. This is a deep water marina. You're part of the Shelter Bay Homeowners Association. Shelter Bay is one of the few communities in the Pacific Northwest that owns and operates its own private marina. Your dock is down there, and we'll go visit the dock momentarily, but you've got this expansive deck for outdoor summer enjoyment. Okay, now we're on the dock. This is a shared dock between you and your neighbor. We're at presently 3.30 in the afternoon and we are at low tide. But even during low tide, this boat, which has a six foot draw, has never touched bottom. So you've got plenty of water underneath your boat. This boat, on the other hand, which is typical of most of the power yachts, only has a three to four foot draw. So you've got plenty of water underneath you. The current owner of this home is not familiar with the age at which this dock was replaced, but this dock is newer. It's got new floats. It's got new decking. 
and it's got a new gangway. So this is gonna last for decades to come. Another feature of this dock is 30 amp power and water. Thank you for visiting 159 Swinomish Drive in Shelter Bay, Laconner, Washington. I'm Alan Workman, your host with John L. Scott Real Estate. For more information on this house, please visit alanworkman.com and enter in 159 Swinomish in the search bar. Thank you very much.